Hey everyone, quick back chemistry basics here. Let's talk about purification of proteins. In order to study particular protein present in the cell, the protein must be purified. The first step in protein purification involves lysis of the cell. Cells are usually lysed by treating them with detergents. In case of bacterial cells, the cells have a thick cell wall, and hence the cells are treated with enzymes like lysozyme, which degrades the bacterial cell wall. Once the cells are lysed, they are centrifuged in order to separate cell debris. The supernatant obtained after centrifugation has proteins and presence of nucleic acids like DNA and RNA. The nucleic acids are usually removed by treating them with enzymes like DNAs and RNAs. The remaining mixture has all the proteins present in the cell. This mixture of protein can be precipitated by ammonium sulfate. By using range of concentration in an increasing order, different proteins present in the cell can be precipitated. This phenomenon by which the proteins get precipitated is known as salting out. Usually protein molecules are surrounded by water molecules which keeps them soluble. The layer of water molecules around the protein is known as the hydration layer. This layer keeps the protein in the soluble form. Addition of ammonium sulfate removes the hydration layer around the protein. As the protein fails to interact with water molecules, the protein now precipitates. Once the protein is precipitated, it is dissolved in an appropriate buffer and further purified by various chromatography techniques.